You are watching the Gopher and Tuck Show. This is the intro and later is the outro. We need a sponsor. Please sponsor us. Mentos Variety. I would need power and we're pros. Tucker needs him a new remote. Jumping for joy like an emo. Suck to our channel, no remote. Gopher fell off the edge. Here we go. Different section now. Yeah, yeah. See, there's a, see, this is a little, the thing and the logo is we'll talk about that. There are I so many saying. guests already arriving. And have you seen the wedding decorations they put up in the gardens? So lady, beautiful. Lady, I don't like you. I don't like this lady. You know, You're supposed to be like the friend and all that, but like, I, she I don't know. She just, Marjorie she, was uh, but a lady when we were sent to serve she's at She's selfish. Garden. But in just a few days' time, we'll be attending to a queen at a royal feast. Royal? Where we're like standing, Lord. we'll be able to see everyone. And everyone will be able to see us. Sarah, it will be Marjorie's day, not ours. Yeah, you dumb I, bitch. I know. I I didn't mean anything by it. You meant something by it. I've been meaning to say what I told you about my family. <coughs> oh, yeah, I that. make a mistake in trusting you. Oh, you probably did. Uh... I'll keep your secret, but my silence has a cost. Yeah. What cost is that? I haven't uh, decided yet. Yeah, I'll, I'll get back to you on that one, dog. Hold on, look. There also, I'm not going to keep my silence if she has, if, if Margaret Lord has me. No, or if anyone asks, really. Hold on. Lord Tarwick. Hi. I don't want to be a handmaiden forever. And this wedding may be the best chance of meeting a husband I'll ever have. I Lady. have to go talk to him. Marjorie Lady. won't notice her for a few minutes longer. Lady. Could you... Make an excuse for me? No, bitch, God. Please, I won't stop you, Sarah. What? But what? I won't make excuses. What have I you. done so far that would lead you to believe I would make an excuse for you? I don't know how many more chances I'll get. Please, just don't tell Marjorie. If she asks, I'm telling. If she doesn't ask, well, there you go. D d stop watching me, dude. I'm sick of you stalking me. I, 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 I was hopeful that you had gotten fucking drowned, but apparently not. Get out of here. Get out of here. Go on, get. Don't just walk up to me. What do you think you're doing? Surprised to see me, eh? A little bit. Because the way you left me, you can't have thought you were going to see me again. You're putting us both in danger. Oh, now you're worried about my safety. I'm worried about my own safety. I saved your bloody life and you ran off and left me to drown. Yeah. I have shown no interest in you this entire time. Look. What do you expect? I'm here to warn you. I was down in Flea Bottom last night when I overheard a couple of Lannister guards talking about. Shh. They already know he's missing, probably dead. They're questioning people, searching for his body. It's not safe for either of us. What did you do? Speak you don't want to know, Lady Mira. I may not look like much, but I know how to survive. I don't remember if I ditched the knife or not. What? What is it? I did pick the knife up. If we're gonna survive this, I, I still <clears> have <throat> his knife. Okay, so I kept it. Oh, no. Not ditch it. I feel like they were gonna find it if it I ditched it. Meantime, but you know they'll probably find it on me stay now. Out of sight. <clears throat> My throat, how? Jesus fuck. Do you forget who I serve? Just don't get in the uh, water. And I'll. I'll watch your back. We're in this I don't want you to what? I, I would like you to go away. Look, I, I appreciate all you've... But I never asked you to help me. You didn't have to. I, I'm a friend I do. Mira. I do have to. My name's Tom. We help each other. Or it's both our heads. You're not my you. friend. You I'm just you, show up in my life. Yeah. I don't know you, Tom. All right, all right. Get the hand, dog. Take I wasn't the hand. just in the gardens that night for my health. I once told you... There are people who'd be willing to help you. People who want you alive. I'm here to make sure that happens. How many times I gotta say go away, dog? Someone, Mira. My lady. Really? A tryst in the bushes <clears throat> with that cold boy. You mind business. Not to say it's wrong, but with all the lords and knights in King's Landing, you just don't want to spoil your chances of a good marriage. Truly, it's nothing, Sarah. So now she's gonna sit on me. He's a friend. Is that how deal really? is? Really? Is that so? He's not a friend either. Like he's just some guy Marjorie who keeps showing up. At the throne room. We don't want to be late. 
You can tell me all about this Lord Tarwick on the way. Well, if you really want to know. I don't. I have no interest in this. First of all, his name's Garibald, and he has this really <coughs> I don't care about no Garibald, dog. the cleverest story about this festival they have. And them subtitles are not fucking sticking up with the rest of the, uh, with, with, and I've with the actual dialogue. And I've given the a list of songs to play for Joffrey <clears throat> at the feast. I assume have some you have now. no problems yeah. with the reigns of Castamere. All well, reigns of Castamere, you do like that one. all the standards. But just to be sure, I'll draw up a list of wedding ballads we favor in Highgarden. Your grace. My lady. Which reminds me. What up, y'all? Joffrey will require his king's guard close at hand during the feast. I'm afraid we'll have no room for your handmaidens. <gasps> but we... What was that? Do you object? I'm Is fine with it. Is that what I heard? I, uh... If you're going Your to Grace, speak out of turn, girl, I... you should finish what you start. We do as you command, Your Grace, and we'll spend the feast wherever it pleases you. You'll spend it mopping the stables, if I please. Okay, I mean, I yeah. I asked your handmaiden here at the Iron Throne, whom she would serve if forced to choose between yourself and the king. She was deferential to the crown then, as she is now. But words are wind. Bitch, how many times the guy say, yeah, I'll do settled. the deal, yo, and then you, you know, I'm just, God, shut up, stay with Joffrey, Cersei. Your yeah, handmaiden sh shut up. Sit elsewhere. It's fine. I'm okay with that job. He's gonna die anyway. And, uh, spoilers. Of course, it has nothing to do with me. Anything for my beloved Joffrey. Lady Marjorie, we may not see eye to eye on everything, but I hope you will at least agree with me that our handmaiden should know their place. And that place is not with my brother, Tyrion. Yeah, I, mean, I mean, he's the one who keeps fucking coming up to me. Like, I, I tried what to say no. What did you mean by that? You and Tyrion. I, decl I, didn't, I declined. What you do reflects on me. If something's going on, I need to know about it. Tyrion, Fine. he offered to help my family. And I declined. He did. Then surely he expects something in return. I declined. Sarah, what do you know of I declined. This? I declined, though. I couldn't say. My lady, she's as much a mystery to me <clears> as she is to you. Evolution I is a mystery. What your intentions were, Mira. You went to a Lannister behind my back. No, I didn't. I didn't, though. I've only ever they forced me. There was no option to not. Oh, Why are you making trouble for me? Game. Game. I just, I declined, though. I, d I didn't do what I had to do. I did nothing. Please, Lady Marjorie. Trust me. I know what I'm doing. I've learned from the best. I don't have the time or patience for your games, Mira. I mean, all no, I'm saying I is, to be my I tried saying no. I need you to be. That was not an option. They, they forced me to go with Tyrion. I don't like the, about, this about these games. Let there be no mistake. If I hear of you speaking so much as a word to Tyrion Lannister again, you can go home to your family. I mean, they probably won't give me any choice. But, alright. I promise I won't speak to him again. I mean, I, I, I wasn't trying to speak to him, but you know. This can't happen again. Blame the game if it does, baby. You just, you just get on the stepping. You all, you all just step away. You, you should probably go with them though. Well, something's happening here. Uh, the old Roderick. This fucking broken ass body now. Looking like fucking Ashton Roderick, Kutcher after guy's ass beat. They're assembling in the courtyard. Oh, these fucking shodes. They've woken the house. You can't let this go on. Don't worry, Charlie. I'll deal with them. I'll beat their asses myself oh, as the, the guy with broken body parts or what have you. Can I do it like a drop kick earlier? I'll do that again. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go handle this. <clears throat> All right, who wants it? Who the fuck wants it? I was out here making a fucking racket for nothing. What is this? It's a parade of dead men if I have my way. Oh, yo, they setting shit on fire, dog. What the fuck? That's mean. Punch that man. Punch that man in the face. What is the meaning of this? I demand to know. <laughs> I'll just laugh. Answer the question you fucking showed. Those are strong words. For a cripple who can't carry a sword. I could. I can carry a sword. 
I only want on to that. Show your respect to Griff Whitehill. Fourth born no. son of Lord Lud Whitehill and commander of this garrison. I do got a zit. I got a zit. Looks like a zit. Cocky Roderick, we used to call you. Swinging your prick round, lording it over my family. Yeah, but got a zit. Look at you. Hey! Roderick the Ruined. I hardly recognize you. But the name fits, don't it? Get your men out of my sight! This is absurd. That sounds like the old Roderick. Beating his chest every chance he got. I don't think he gets it. No, my lord. I don't think he does. Your brother Ethan didn't get it either. You bite your tongue. I am in charge now. I don't know about that. And the first thing you need to know is that if I am not happy, no one is happy. So my men are taking over your great hall. That's where we'll quarter from now on. Uh, I don't know about that, You'll Chief. Have to go through me. I won't have my men sleeping out in your barn in shit and filth. I don't care if you're happy or not. You'll quarter where I tell you. I wasn't fucking asking, Roderick. And what's more, you will treat my men right. I don't know about that. Done. And if they're eating wormy bread, then your people better be eating shit off the ground. I'm not here to keep them in line. I'm here to keep you in line. If your men don't like it here, you can march them back to High Point. Watch yourself, Roderick. This is against the King's law. You've no right to make such demands. I have every right. Uh, We're here under the orders no. of Bruce Bolton, Warden of the North. Yeah, but Bruce is stupid. So I will be in your halls. I will be in your courtyard. I will sit on your fucking council and be in your bedchambers if I bloody well please. You can't do this, little. Bastard. You can't just do whatever. We'll do what we were sent here to do. You're mad, Griff. This is my house, and you will do as I say. Why my house, dog. I listen to some cripple with half a face. Because it's my house. Me and my men will take our place in your. This guy's not listening. Unless you think you and your army can stop me. Probably not, but you know, well, uh, that, that's the option I'll choose no. if I can. You know better than that. Let me choose. Let me choose options. Let me choose you things, game. Be. This is out. Outrageous. There we go. You can't go in there. We can and we will. It's a stop them. want this all to end right okay. now. Eh? The option oh, was stop I them, not just say a thing you. once and then he keeps going. Come on. Not much of a stopping them thing. Like, that seemed like it was an important decision and it just did nothing. Again, Telltale. Do stuff with the decisions. Make the matter, maybe? Cause that didn't seem to matter. Griff Whitehill, that snot nosed fourth born, parading in here like a conquering fucking hero. It was bad enough when it was just the soldiers. We can't live with them under our roof, soiling our house. I know you tried to stop them, my lord, but we can only take this occupation for so long. Our people will break, and the way Griff Whitehill came in. That's clearly what he wants. Whether he rides out on horseback or ends up in the ground, Griff Whitehill won't be here long. See, you would think. I'll see to it. You you think that like I would I would have options to do that but to at least attempt that, but you know, of our troubles. really not. The end of them. <clears throat> we need the to old babies, baby. Pieces. Whitehill men are just in our house. They've raided our lands, burnt farms, and cut down our trees. All the way from here to High Point. How That's a small amount it? on the map. By smashing its head. Griff is in the head. It's his father. Perhaps. But Griff is here. We have access to him. True. And they have Ryan. Yeah, that's fine. I don't care about Ryan. I'm alright with that. Let them kill that dude. I don't, I don't care about that kid. Think I care about that kid? I don't care about that kid. He carved these soldiers himself. I don't care what Gwyn Whitehill may have told you at the funeral. Who knows what horrors they're putting him through? Held prisoner at High Point. Yeah, but like, I don't care. You can't forsake his safety. I can. I absolutely can. But we have to do something. Yeah. My lord. At least give us a target to aim for. Griff's head? Yeah, stuff and such. Alright. 
Uh, so that's save run. Yeah, that one, obviously. Fucking obviously. Come on. We have to push Grip and his soldiers out of Iron Wrath. They're Get the most this. immediate threat. But Roderick, what of Ryan? Yo, dog, I do. Knowing the White Hills, they got him and leave him at our gates. Not Again, care. My lady, if we do nothing, we are dead on our feet. Our enemies are not just that. Ryan could be dead. That's okay. I don't care about him. We must secure Iron Wrath. So we have a home to bring Ryan back to. Don't forget him. I already forgot, baby. Then, it's decided. We take back our home. We lost most of our men with Gregor at the Twins. We can probably gather another 30 or 40 men. But the Whitals are already fortified inside Ironrath. Thankfully, Roderick secured an alliance with the Glenmores. The old Glenmores. mean nothing until after the marriage. That means we have to count on Asher and Mira. How? Asha means to sail home from Essos with a company of hardened cell swords. I mean, it means to, but uh... We'll need to pay them for it. Which is why Mira's part to play is just as crucial. She can get us the coin we need. Yeah, in Mira ain't doing you all don't that. imagine we have the luxury of waiting for them. Roger's already pissed at her from shit, some shit that I couldn't even control. I have faith in my children. I don't think Lud Whitehall will kindly stand by while we pull ourselves together. If we have to go to battle before we're ready, we risk losing everything. But sometimes you have no choice. That time may indeed come, but it's not now. I will be the decider the of that. Aren't ready for war. It won't be long before you're able to take action yourself. Well, one way or another, there's a fight brewing, so I have much to prepare and men to train. You go ahead and My do that, dog. Man, that dude didn't even wait for me to say he can leave. He just speaks out. I respect it. You got anything to say no. now, dude? There may be something we can do now. A voice oh, so from Jesus, my How fucking quick does this dude get back? He was at the wall. I spoke with her at Brother. the funeral. As did I. And she's willing to meet. Away from her father's guards. I may not be your sentinel. But please consider this. It would be wise to hear what she has to say. Arrange right. a meeting. What she has to say may prove useful. I believe she can be trusted, but best use caution nonetheless. I will throw caution to the wind. And I'll make sure no one else knows, for now at least. If I die, good. Eh, you know, it's not probably not gonna I die because it's fucking right telltale. Win, and she may even help us in High Point when the time comes. I don't know how many people die in these games that are main characters. Regardless of the actions you choose. And that was my story. Well, not, not your best. The Kirby one was better. I, I, well, I mean, you didn't really give me much to work with, Jess. Fucking, what do you want from me? The, you're the, the improv. Love you, buddy. Love you too, pal. Yeah. yeah. So I got this rash on my 